Yeah, that hurts. You know, it definitely hurts on a pitcher, especially. It makes them have to throw extra pitches, especially when he was already struggling a little bit in that first inning with his command. So to have to throw, you know, 10, 12 extra pitches, you know, that, it's hard to come back from. But, you know, I was proud of the guys the way they did. They didn't let it bother them. You know, they came in and we just kept playing baseball. A little bit down, and uh, fortunately, you know, we were able to make just enough plays there, and um, we got lucky they kicked it around a little bit in that one inning. proud of the way our guys played. You know, we spotted them a few unearned runs early, um, but my guys at never any point did they stop, did they feel like they were down or out. You know, they kept battling. They did the little things right after that. You know, the rest of the game, they played a great baseball game. You know, Adrian struggled a little bit finding his command in the beginning, but as he went on, he got stronger throughout the day, you know, and he did a great job keeping us in it even after, you know, being in a higher pitch count than we wanted. I always tell those guys, it's the, the little things are the ones that decide the close games. And, you know, we had the exact same thing against Midview. If, if um, if their guy, if their midview center fielder doesn't go for the, the catch on that one ball and, and put a guy at second, I'm not sure that we would have scored that, mm -hmm. that inning either. So, it's that's where experience comes in and and just you know perseverance. You know, one thing I give my guys credit for is they they are uh, they're winners. They know how to close, and so they um, they do a good job of doing whatever they have to do.